my name is Feli, Rafi, Jessica, Marissa, Bond, Jenna, Drejo, Talissa, and I'm part of the Girl Scouts of Hawaii International Space Station team. Let me take a few minutes to share some interesting details about our experiment. Our experiment involves growing arugula plants in space and studying the effect microgravity may have on the chemical composition compared to plants growing on Earth. Now we aren't just growing one, or two, but three plants, each with a different fertilizer nutrient combination. Our experiment is self-contained, sealed, and does not require help from the astronauts on the International Space Station. Our project was held in pre-flight staging for over three months. Due to the circumstances, we had to design a system that would prevent plant growth until it reached the ISS. In order to grow plants in space, we had to pack a few essentials with the experiment for the trip. First, we needed a computer. Actually, not one, but two computers. Then we needed a water supply. Not that kind of water supply, this kind. We needed a watering system to deliver water to the plants according to our watering schedule. We used two cameras to take pictures so we could download them during the space flight and monitor plant growth. We built a special white lighting system to photograph the plants and designed another lighting system that simulates sunlight to create the optimal growth conditions. Last but not least, we had three plant growth compartments, which each included seeds, growth medium, and for some, fertilizer. Yep. As you can see, we packed a lot of materials in our experiment. We, we had several physical constraints as well as NASA space flight rules we had to work within. Our experiment was not allowed to exceed 200 milliwatts of power. That may sound like a lot, but an average blow dryer uses 1,200 watts of power just to turn on. That's about 6,000 times more powerful than our experiment. Amazing! 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 The greatest challenge for us was fitting all our materials, plants, computers, water, watering system, and two lighting systems into a space this big, the size of two butter sticks. We designed it, built it, and launched it. But
Are you good? From the astronauts on the International Space Station. Can I say that again? Water to the plants according to our watering schedule. I'm gonna say that again. Was NASA space? Ah. <laughs> you can't hear. It's okay. You can just just do it. Okay, go for it. Like right now. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't miss it at all. You're so. Like... Can't see. <laughs> One more time. Look at the camera when you say those last. Oh, fun. Yes. Uh, a computer, not. Uh, <laughs> we had to work within. Can't breathe. <laughs> so I just. Whenever you're ready. I can just read it. And studying the effects of microgravity. Ah, uh, yeah. plant grows. Yeah, wait, can we read it? Uh, yeah. Going one. Oh my gosh, I was gonna try to do the two thing. That that doesn't make sense. <laughs> Optimal growing system. <laughs> Last one. <laughs> May sound a lot, but an average blow driver. <laughs> a blow driver? <laughs> never heard of one. Not just growing, not one. <laughs> we need to rewrite this.